Welcome back, my people. My name is Luchi Lloyd. Thank you guys for joining. Thank you for tuning in. If you are new, new here, hello and welcome. Uh, guys, in this channel, we, we upload a lot of videos, travel, education, lifestyle, celebrity, gossip, etc., etc., etc. So feel free to leave me your comments below. Everybody is free to comment here and also subscribe to this channel, uh, like the video and also share. So let's dive into the video. Um, there's a lot of things happening, guys. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. So I'm coming to tell you guys now. Uh, this news uh, is a reply to uh, Wike, the governor of River State. Mazen Namor de Carlo replied to Governor Wike uh, concerning the allegation, uh, concerning the allegations he labeled the IPOP people in court so i will just read the headline then analyze a little bit this video is going to be a very short one um it's just for people to be aware it's just for people to know it's just for people to you know be careful before you label somebody before you come into conclusion the news said the leader of indigenous people of biafra ipop mass nandekalo has replied to the allegation he received from the governor of river state Wink, uh, Mazen Nandekalu, who took to his uh, Twitter page to offer a reply to governor, advised him to make his finding before coming to conclusions. He insisted that IPOP member we are not responsible for the killing of any police officer. The IPOP leader also issued a warning to wiki that he will be entirely responsible if anything if anything happened to ipop like bear france lives anything that if anything happened to the ipop people that he will be the consequence he will be at the consequence and he is going to you know like hold responsible for anything if anything happened to bear france in um if anything happened to Bia France, Portacot, because of uh, his, uh, you know, um, saying some things that he doesn't get, uh, he don't have any uh, proof about it. So for him saying things that he don't have proof about it, if anything happened to the IPOP people in Portacot, they should hold him for responsible, according to what Martin Namotekalu said. You see now, this life... When we came at that statement, I know that um, he was carried away with uh, negativity people around him. He was carried away with, you know, in this life, when you allowed yourself to be fed with negativity about people, that is what always happened. Finally, finally, people will end up, you know, pushing you into trouble pushing you into a bigger problem, into big trouble. So it's just, uh, it's very, don't allow yourself to be filled with negativity. Don't allow, to, don't surrender yourself with negative people around you. So this thing that happened to Wike is like a side talk, like uh, it's trying to show that he loved the police people and the armies more than the citizens. IPOP is a Biafra, then form the group to restore Biafra. So no matter whatever you said, the Nigerian government to label them or tag them, that is not the issue. Do you believe on what the Nigerian government said? So if you only you can also do the same thing that the Nigerian government they did to the IPOP, it shows that all of you guys are the same. And it shows that you, Mike, you believe on what the Nigerian government they said about the IPOP. Is IPOP people bigger than uh, are they? They have they ever keep people the way they uh, the uh, Boko Haram they are doing it or not? What about the headsmen going to fire people with their arrow, killing people, raping women? The IPOP has IPOP done has IPOP do what these people, this particular Boko Haram and headsmen they are doing? The answer is no. Then why you don't label them? If okay, you made a statement that is the Nigeria government, not you, but you believe on the Nigeria government, still repeat. The same thing that Nigerian government has said about IPOP, still repeat it with your mouth without uh, making your findings, before findings were happening, without the finding out if what happened is true or a lie. 
you never do that. It's just because of uh, you have that thing in your mind. You have that negativity about IPOP people in your mind. That is why you just like, it's okay. Let me say it. Let me do it. I don't care. Whatever. You see? So, uh, in your last, because I did a video that I was telling you guys that. How do you know? Do you have any proof to show that IPOP people did what you claimed? Do you have any group? Something just happened in the middle of uh, in the middle of uh, middle of the protest. That is when you released your statement. That is when you tag your own brothers. That's why you tag your own sisters in the middle of protest. You never even cool down. Let the protest finish so that you people will take your time to investigate. It just take that uh, you know that angry in you about the IPOP people and just say what you said and now you are regretting it, whatever you have said with your mouth. And you form like you are helping the army and the soldier, you claim that they lost their life, giving the family members. They uh, say you give them some millions and whatever for your own security purposes, for your own benefit interests. Because we are now compensating the family of the uh, police people you claim the IPO people killed. For people to know that what you're saying is true. We know all these games. We know the game. We want people to believe that what you said that really IPO people did it. So for that, you have to compensate the family with uh, uh, some... What about the, the citizens that uh, the SAS people kill? Do you compensate them with a bag of rice or some millions for their family? Do you give any of their family scholarship? No, I'm just talking about the uh, the, 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 the the citizens of uh, Potakot people that SARS people killed. Do you compensate their family members? The answer is no. It's, these people like to do eye service. They like to do these people. They are full of hypocrites. Hypocrites in the highest order. Nigerian politicians. That is what they do. So you just like, uh, it's like when they say they have disbanded SAS, then immediately they say that the SWATs will start to work immediately without training, without them having proper training, just like that. That is what you just did there. Okay. So now you talk the IPO people, a terrorist group. Now, immediately, immediately, uh, sorry, you 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 said the IPOP people killed the police officers without you making in, uh, your own investigation very well before coming into conclusion. You never did that. You just quickly for your own selfish interest. You just quickly. The reason why you're doing that because you're scared because many other police officers will not allow to come out. They won't like to, to you know. To attack the protesters, just do it quick, 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 and then we maybe they will be scared to come even to protect you, because life is better than money. Okay, so a lot of them may be scared even with your offer, so that is why you quickly do whatever you did. We know the game, we can, we know the game. So next time, Governor Wicke, before you talk, open your mouth to say or do anything. This is how you demolish some people's uh, uh, hotels and their building in uh, Portacourt there during the COVID time without you investigating. You demolish people's properties without you investigating. You're always quick to act. You're always, always quick to do something. You're always, always quick to, you know, level somebody. You're always quick to destroy people's uh, properties. At the end of the day, you start to make you turn. It's too late, oh. It's too late, Governor Wicke. It's too late. So next time, before you do anything, you tag people or do whatever. Find, find out. Find out very well. Because I know a lot of people, they are facing what they don't know about today. Because of people like you. Okay? People go to prison. People go to jail because of what they don't know about. Because of hatred, envy, and jealousy. They enter into trouble. So that is the same thing that you're always doing. You always uh, you know, attack people without you getting the proper information, without you coming into conclusion. You just do your own thing, which is so, so bad. It's very bad. The governor will can change. It's very bad. Next time, before you conclude, before you do anything, uh, before, you, before you come into conclusions, make sure you verify. Make sure you make your research very well. 
don't go to listening to he say she say or go for one government call you and start to tell you do this do that or one person call you and start to spoil your uh, your name for nothing for nothing they will spoil your name for nothing because you never make your own investigation maybe they want to spoil your reputation so you quickly they quickly they act always you are quick to react to react in things including them to find out is this true or a lie even if the government did as you claim that the government is the one not you but you repeat it during in the middle of a protest that a lot of things is going on the ones that they they, they, they they happen in lagos why you not tag them do look why you not tag them anyway you people should be just be no we are not happy with we are not happy with the, the attitudes that you guys are portraying to the public to the citizens we are not that is so bad it's very bad so my people let me know what you think below my next three men oluchi lloyd uh subscribe to this channel share the video and i will see you soon bye